name is Lexi and I'm a pilot at Airspeed XA Series. Getting the competitive stats right is pivotal in racing. Why? Because we always want to be the fastest, the first. So if there is someone in front of us, it creates a little bit of danger for us and we need to figure out how to take over. And if you start fastest, you don't have to worry about it. Currently, we tested a couple of configurations when it goes to our competitive stats, starting from the air or starting from the ground. Now, with the air, we decided that it's not necessarily the best idea because we need to hover in front of the start gate for a little while and this eats up the battery, which could be used for more competitive and fast racing. So we decided, okay, ground it is. Now, we tested a couple of configurations, starting from the line, which turned out not to be necessarily the best because all of the speeders will have to go to this first gate and this creates a risk of a crash. So we decided to go for a staggered, meaning that one of the speeders is in front, the second one in the back, and so on and so forth. Now, is it on the left or on the right? This will depend on the track to track basis. So in the HUD, we do see where another speeder is, which means that it gives us a little bit more of a safety because we can know if the speeder is on our right or on our left or whatever they are. And also it helps us with information on our height and our battery levels. Testing competitive flying was a lot of fun and it was a little bit stressful as well because from my own experience I always wait one extra second so everyone goes in front and have their own meters. Now here I had to relearn this thing because this will not happen and I absolutely need this one extra second to get in front of everyone else. So it's constant learning and constant fun. In motorsport, what you want to have as a driver is usually this nice lateral lane. Now here at ASP, that we have another dimension added because we're also racing vertically. So what you want to have as an ASP, the pilot, is to have as best line in all three dimensions as possible. The difference between the stabilized and acro mode and air speed are pretty huge because now that we are flying in the stabilized mode, that means that our flight controller, which is the brain of the aircraft, is trying to be at the set angle at all times. Now, this will not happen in acro. As you can see on the graphic right now, this means that during the flight we're getting a little bit of a pushback because the speeder is trying to fight the angle that we are getting it while we are trying to competitive start. This will not happen in acro and that means that we'll have a better and smoother flight, which is pivotal for racing. 